Well, first of all, congratulations on the climb. Obviously, it's uh, doing great internationally. Everybody's really excited. Uh, I understand uh, from a production point of view, it was a pretty quick turnaround from short to feature. Uh, were you just immediately hit the ground running, or how did that go for you? So, I mean, it was uh, from the time that I came on board, we were shooting um, four weeks later, which is would tend to be typical amount of time for a small independent film, but. We, you know, uh, we had um, we didn't have the benefit of soft prep. You simply had get get on something six months in advance, and we're slowly making decisions. We're finding locations, yada yada. This was like go 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 go. So uh, I was living. I live out here, but um, flew back. To, I'm from New York. Flew back, and we immediately went to work. And it was like we got to just like solve as check as many boxes as we can as fast as possible. Um, so there was a fair bit of like um, you know building the the plane as we're taking off sort of thing. But uh, but it, it was really cool. I mean, it was a super uh, inspiring and, and oddball experience in that like we everybody became kind of a true Scotsman about making it so everybody signed up and just like jumped into the fray and we figured it out yeah wonderful uh, working with a team obviously you have two guys they're co collaborators how do you come on board how do you integrate into that team so they're they're old friends of mine and uh, I love them dearly and uh, really the the key to working with Mike and Kyle and maybe this is true of a lot of other people but I don't have this example is you need to just sort of surrender to their kind of way of working which is very they have very very deeply held like opinions about certain elements and so it's committing to those things and trying to support them and um, and if you support them they'll give it back tenfold so really it was about advocating for them couldn't afford everything but we would figure out look we can't can't do X but we can do Y um, it's figuring out how to play in a game of compromises that don't make things feel like a compromise yeah finally uh the climb is still forthcoming. We're from Canada. Yeah. So if you had to sell somebody on watching the climb, what would you say? Um, if you've ever had a friendship or a relationship that you know couldn't you couldn't quite let go of or that stuck to you, uh, this is a movie to watch because it's about the complicated nature of you know what it's like to have a friend that you love even though they have elements of themselves that suck. <laughs> yeah. All right. Wonderful. Congratulations. Have a good evening.